purchasing your first property can be a daunting task. So today, we're here at PMW Plus to speak to somebody about what steps you should take to acquire your first home. Let's go. So I'm here with uh, Matt Durham from PMW Plus, and he's gonna to talk to us a little bit about what options first home buyers have in today's market. How are you, Matt? Good, Josh, yourself? Yeah, going well, thank you. So first of all, let's talk about um, the newest offering from the government, mm -hmm. the first home loan deposit scheme. Yes. What can you tell me about that for first home buyers? Uh, it is very new. There's a lot of confusion out there at the moment about it. Yes. However, what it is allowing is people who only have 5% deposit, to buy their first home without having to pay lenders mortgage insurance or having to hit up parents for guarantees or extra money. So the government guarantee up to 15% yep. of the purchase price, um, which means first home buyers can get the market sooner rather than later at the moment, which is great. And that would also eliminate mortgage insurance? Um, yes, uh, it will eliminate, or can eliminate lenders mortgage insurance, yep. um, which is probably one of the biggest costs to a first home buyer these days. So tell me, um, first home buyer, you think you, you could be eligible for this. Mm -hmm. um, is there any like income thresholds? Good question. 125,000 for individuals, 200 for couples. Okay. Um, regionally, here in Orange, we're limited to $450,000 uh, purchase price. Okay. Um, major cities, 700,000. So it's a little lower here than others, but a lot of first home buyers would fit that bill. Here. Yeah, definitely. They should still be able to get into maybe a new home or existing. Absolutely. So that, that applies for both? 100%. Yep. Yeah, excellent. Now let's say, for example, I'm a first home buyer and I don't meet the criteria yes. for the deposit scheme. Mm -hmm. um, where do I go next? A few options. Uh, obvious ones get more of a deposit. Obviously you don't have that, which is why yep. you're looking at this option. You can pay lenders mortgage insurance. So if you borrow between 80% up to 95%, you can pay lenders mortgage insurance. One that's becoming more popular um, is the family guarantee. So you actually get a mum or dad come in and guarantee that amount above 80%, up to potentially 95, even 100%. Sometimes 105% yep. of the purchase price, which okay. means you don't need a deposit, um, you don't pay lenders mortgage insurance, and so long as your income can service the loan. Um, that's probably been the most popular option to avoid lenders mortgage insurance prior to the government guarantee. Yeah, okay, all right. Now, going back to the first home loan deposit scheme, mm -hmm. uh, how does a first home buyer, um, how do they find what banks are offering um, this scheme? Um, good question. It took us a while to actually find out who they are. There's 26 lenders. Yep. Um, they've got to go to the site um, because a lot of these lenders, a lot of people wouldn't have heard of. The only two majors are NAB and CBA. Yep. Um, and they've pretty much exhausted their allocation. So it's to the other 24 banks now that have ac access to it. Yep. And Whilst you have, people have access to it, um, there's only a few off the top of my head that I can tell you about, but yep. go to the First Home Loan Deposit Scheme site and they're yep. all listed there. We might even put that on our bio so that you can link and, and find it yourselves if that makes it easier. Um, okay, so tell me then, we've gone through that path, we've looked on the internet, we sort of think we might be eligible for something. Yes. What do we do next? Um, give us a call. Yep. Um, or your broker a call, I should say. Yep. Um, have a chat to them. Uh, our normal process is we talk to our clients, try and get as much information as we can about them. Yep. Um, give them a guide as to what we think they can and can't do. And if we think we can do something, get a questionnaire out to them, they complete that for us. Great. Allowing us to prepare for a meeting, we catch up and present their options and uh, solutions to their issues yep. and uh, look to get them. Normally it's pre-approved first, but if there's a property already in place, we go straight to formal loan approval. 